Hey everybody, Anthony Sevens back again for yet another product review. Today we're going to be reviewing this lovely full-headed Spider-Man mask based around the design from Spider-Man Homecoming. This was made by a uh, Russian cosplayer, and uh, I'm not even going to guess, but the name of the cosplayer can be found on Etsy.com, and it is Cosplay Mask, letter R, letter U. He also makes a bunch of other different types of props. Uh, this mask runs about uh, 95 something with tax. I think it paid like 115 bucks for it. But what it is, it is a full size lycra material with a zipper in back so it's nice and snug. It is all fit to my head so it is custom. And there is a uh, plastic shell that goes full frontal for the shape of the face and a bit on the top of the head, almost to probably mid-range in the head, and then he actually takes the material, he hand draws all the webbing on it, and then, uh, so basically it fits my head pretty damn perfect. It's nice and snug, it's nice and tight. Um, can see very clearly out of it. It does come fully with magnetic eyes, just as any really cool Spider-Man mask should, but that looks damn scary, so. <laughs> go ahead and snap the eyes back here back into place so they look lovely awesome stuff now a couple of questions to be answered are the eyes um, uh, specially made to not fog up unfortunately no if you're wearing it you're talking around in it the eyes do fog up a little bit but it is very breathable material the plastic shell that is underneath the mask does have some breathing holes. So what he did is he winds up creating the shell from scratch based around the dimensions that you send to him and then he uses the appropriate amount of fabric and he glues the fabric onto the mask so this way nothing is sliding around. You know, He, he glues it uh, properly so that uh, you don't have to worry about adjusting anything. So it's already adjusted for you. So to get this off kind of show you. You unzip the back and you carefully pull it off. So just to give you a brief look on the inside of the mask, you can see there's a lot of breathable holes in there. So it does, it does limit, uh, as far as the mask fogging up and stuff, it does limit that very much so. And I think, you know, for $115, um, this is a pretty incredible product, and uh, I couldn't have asked for anything cooler. This is probably the absolute best Spider-Man mask I've ever owned in my life. For those of you who don't know me, I am a huge fan of Spider-Man, and I had owned one previous Spider-Man mask that I never did a review on, because I'll show you why. Maybe I won't show you why. I think I got rid of that mask. But it was a very cheap old pullover. The lenses were all flimsy. The lenses here are made of a hard plastic. Everything looks 3D printed or hand carved. So, you know, give you a better look. There is quite a bit of detail there in the eyes, which is very, very awesome. And for, uh, for someone who hand drew the pattern of the webbing, I mean, it's pretty stellar. I mean, at a quick glance, just walking around, it looks like a freaking Spider-Man mask. And, um, you know, again, be it that this is very custom made, you know, to go ahead and put it on, you know, this is, you just adjust it a little bit. The foam, he has the foam around the eyes on the inside. So everything, it feels like it, I guess you can say for lack of better terms, snaps into place and then you pull the material around, make sure it's nice and good. Pull on the zipper, easily zip it up in the back once all the material is out from underneath, rolled up, and there you have it. And, you know, even though it's not the whole entire Spider-Man cosplay thing, you could do many different things with this mask. You can do, you know, just the Spider-Man mask, maybe do some gloves. Um, you don't have to do the whole, you know, Zentai suit, and you can still make it a, a pretty believable and very attractive piece you know like you come into my basement and i have this thing most of the time sitting on a mannequin head so you have it on a mannequin head i mean it just you know just it's an eye catcher it's a head turner 
definitely a conversational piece. So I'm going to post the link below in case you're interested in ordering one yourself. And uh, that's pretty much all I got, Spider-Man mask. <laughs> but thanks again for tuning in. If you have any questions, comments, concerns, leave them in the comment box below. This is Anthony Sevens, or your friendly neighborhood Spider-Man, signing off. Until we meet again, please take care of yourself, take care of each other.